hello and as you can see from the title of the video I'm going to be putting away my almost entire Woods' set set I have just about every photo card I am missing one regular photo card and some of the china and fan sign pieces so I'm gonna get started with that So it's a lot to put away even though I'm missing some stuff um, and I did already sleeve them and put them in some sort of order. They're currently in these fitted sleeves but I do plan to transfer my entire Woods collection to these Dragon Shield ones. Oh, I just haven't gotten to it yet. But let's flip to where I have it set up. I think this is enough pages for all of these uh, but we'll see as we go. <laughs> Okay, so if you've seen any of my other Woods videos, I always organize them in groups of five, since they come in sets of fives. The backs match. So usually I do the five matching pieces in an X pattern and then use fillers or other cards to fill in the other spaces. So I'm going to go through and do that with the ones that I have. So first up is this set. Um, I honestly adored this comeback so much. I know it was a mini album technically, with not very much song-wise, but a lot to collect. A lot more too. Um, I do have all the postcards as well, but I'm still waiting for new two pocket pages to come in, so I won't probably do that until after. But this is the set. I try and arrange them in some kind of order that matches, like these have a yellow hint to them, these are pretty red, and this is like the odd one out. And then the next set, this one which has the iconic glasses card, I love this card so much, and I love this one too. So these ones, oh, I wonder why these two have red. So yeah, my layout works. Like, these two are yellow, so I'll put them together. This one's kind of the odd one out. And then these two match. And so far, it's really worked well with Woods cards. I feel like maybe at some point it'll mess up, but for now it works. <laughs> Curious why these two are red. And then I have this set. With the cowboy-looking hat and the face jewelry. This is another PC I really like. So for this one, I wasn't sure how I wanted to lay them out, but I kind of like this line of three. So I think that works. <laughs> and then the next page is this set. And this is the one where I am missing a card. But it is on the way. It's just stuck in customs. <laughs> so that'll go in this spot. It's the one where he's wearing this outfit, but he's making a heart above his head. And then the last photo card set is this one. I know people prefer selfie cards, but I think Woods' cards are really cute and unique and you can get a lot of photos that you normally couldn't if it was a selfie style. Like this one. <laughs> Super adorable. Okay, and then that's this set. So for the QR PCs, I'm going to use those as filler in between these. So we'll go back to the beginning. So I'll do that for all of these spots, except for this first page. For the first page, I'm actually going to fill them with these Make Star ones in three of these spots and leave this space open. I was fortunate enough to win um, a PR Pola, so when I decide to not display this, it'll go here with the Make Star photo card set since that's the fan sign that I got them in. So for these, I'll put them here. And 
then, yeah, like I said, the Polaroid will go there when I'm not displaying it. And then the rest of them, I will use the QR photo cards. And I'll just go in number order, one, two, three, four. So it's a full page. And I love seeing full pages. So that's what that looks like. And eight. So that's this page complete. And then these last four. For this last page of five, I'm going to put in the Kino cards. So I have the full set for these as well. Oh, these kind of match. <laughs> That's funny. I tried to balance them with like the white background and then like a colored background. That works. Okay. So that is all of those put away. And then here are some pages for more fan sign photo cards. So the first set is with drama. For this, I'm not sure how I want to display them or if I'll have filler for them until all of my cards arrive. But <laughs> this will have to do for now. And then this page will have the MMT cards, I think. I think these are MMT. Version 1 and then version 2. I absolutely adore this card. This is such a cute set. And then this is the, the Chinese pre-order benefit card. I do have the rest of the set on the way as well as his richening sets on the way, but they're stuck in customs. So I actually have a couple more woods things to take care of, so I'm just going to do that really quick. So these are for the set era. These are more of the China fan sign pieces. Um, if I'm correct, <laughs> oop, not this one. Uh, this one is another of the fan sign by itself. This one is the pre-order benefit. And then these three came as a set. So I'm gonna put the sticker here. And then these two pieces here. I really love this one. This one kinda just looks like one of the, like these two look just like a PC from the album, but this one is really nice. So that means my China pan signs are complete. The other ones are with drama. And then all I'm waiting for is the richening ones, which will take forever because apparently that site takes a long time to ship. But that means I also have the last actual album PC that I needed. So it's the one where he's doing his little heart above his head. And it was just the last one I needed for this set, but it was stuck in customs for a bit. So that means the set is all done. This is where a Polaroid goes. So this is all done, which is really satisfying. Just waiting on those three technically, but all done. 